bunch of noise. And it's really falling. That ice is really falling. Town and Pop's truck. <laughs> oh well. Uh, I'm glad Pop's got that all uh, that cover on now. How to get it with the phone camera? Oh, you trying to get out there? <laughs> oh well. Uh... Oh, it's coming down. I right, falling off the trees. Well, it's definitely falling. It's cold. Falling, falling off the trees. Uh oh. Ow. Uh. Won't hit me on my shoulder. That hurt. Crazy, but we'll check back in with y'all later. I'm back. Um, I wanted to share um, today when I had like a weirdest, weirdest dream ever that I ever had. Um, it, was, it happened this morning. I was like still asleep, but it was like I couldn't wake up out of my dream and it felt like so real. I was with like a group of people. I, um, I couldn't see their faces. I couldn't see who was with me in the group, but all around me was like darkness, like closing in, and it was like black and black and white. So I was trying. I was telling everybody to run this way, run that way. 
then all of a sudden uh, I seen an opening just in time for like the whole group to like get out safely and somehow um, it was like a trail and I told everybody to run that way because the crazy thing about it what was after us was some kind of some kind of creature um, I didn't I didn't even look back I was just told everybody to keep running so after we kept running and towards the end I got bit um, on my back in the dream and it was like it felt so real because my body was shaking and I couldn't like wake up out of the dream like it felt so real then once I finally like um, woke up clearly and that's when my shoulder on my right side was hurting really, really bad. And I did not go to sleep with no pain until this dream I had. So I was like, it was crazy because I didn't have no pain on my shoulder until I experienced this dream. And like, that's crazy. And I never had a dream like that before because it was, it was no color in it. It was just all black and white and it was just weird weird dream but comment below if you ever had what what was your weirdest dream that you ever had because that was definitely the first i would say the first dream i ever had the weirdest but at the end i'm glad that i got everybody safe and stuff out of that dream but i woke up exhausted i woke up my shoulder hurting and i just woke up just it's weird, but I remember the dream, so it was crazy. It was very, very crazy. So, me and grandma were on our way to go pick up pops, and I just wanted to share that story with y'all. And definitely feel free to share me your um, weird nightmare dream and stuff. But today, um, it's cloudy and all the ice is gone so I thank God that we didn't lose power yesterday and last night so it was definitely it was definitely a blessing to still have power and definitely definitely keep the people in Houston Texas and different parts of Texas in prayer because they are really um, having it hard down there uh, the southeast, that what southeast state, the southeast, southeast state. Um, definitely um, keep them in prayer because they're really having a hard time, like with food and water and power. And some people have passed away from the, like the coldness down there, and it definitely hit my heart hearing that. And it definitely is. We just keep them in prayer. And, But other than that, we just on the road. It's crazy how storms can affect um, affect our lives, and sometimes we can prepare for it. And sometimes we don't have time, have the amount of time to prepare for it. They still building. They still building on their um, medical center.
Taking the humidifier out. Pretty good. That's one humidifier. And then the other one. Air purifier. Air purifier. Oh, it's upside down. <laughs> What are you taking out? Piece of tape. Oh.
That's a big size filter. This is your HEPA filter. And the house with the, the dandruff and all that. Well, it filters, see, it filters the air. And then it's carbon filter. It filters and helps filter the odor. Gotcha. Now that's a screen, fine screen. Now, eliminate particulate. I gotta be sure that Okay. There's no fat plastic film over it. Looks funny. It does. Well, that's a lot of stuff inside of it. Okay. So basically it has one, two, three, four pieces. Okay. Is it very similar to the one we they are out scratching and finding something to eat? <laughs> oh wow. Let's see if I can film this some more. See, scratching. What's happening? They scratch and look for worms and everything. Did I come from there? I must have found some worms. There's two roosters in the room. That's what's up. Let me move on out. Yeah, yeah, you can. Just tell me stop when you want to stop. Okay. Get the rooster. Okay. As we come on around, you take more and more pictures. There's the goats. Those are goats. <laughs> they got their butt towards the camera. <laughs> <laughs> you see those three laying down up there? Okay. That's the alpacas. Oh man, that was a perfect shot because his face was up. There you go. Huh? They're probably trying to mate one another. No, it's <laughs> <laughs> What in the world are <laughs> they doing? <laughs> yeah, I think. Okay, well, here's that huge house. It's a three or four story. I do want to come over in. Yeah. Over there, is, but you can't see it. You can see it from the road. It's huge. Man. Okay, well, now, the wall, we can, no, that's the same one looking at each other. 
the chickens are coming up here now. You tell me when you want me to stop. Okay. Open a bit further. Let's see. Let me zoom out the song. <laughs> All right, you can go a little bit more. I don't know if that's a female because she's got a milk. So that's True. a female. This one don't look like it has a bag. I believe he's a ma uh, male. Right. I think this is a little female black one here. Oh, got that one. Well, that's a perfect picture right there. I'm trying to zoom in. Now it's looking at me. You got it? Yep. So you can get some of Mhm. Yeah, they just chilling. Oh, they know we here. And the, see those standing up over there. The barn. Let you give you an idea of how furry they are. True. See, they make wool. They make uh, clothes out of wool. They're wool. Right. Do. That's cool. Mm -hmm. You take a picture of the old board right there. Right here. Mm -hmm. See the Some of the see real one? That barn there. Oh right here. Okay. That's a real old barn. Can you see it? Yes. Hello. Got it. Oh yeah, definitely. That was cool to see. Mm -hmm. And I video record at the same time. Mm -hmm. Thanks for showing me that. Mm -hmm. That was okay. a blessing to see that sometime. Yeah. Mm, it's very cloudy. It's one cloudy day. This is 158 we're on. Gotcha. Okay, let's go right in here. Alright, we definitely um holler at y'all later. Peace. We love y'all. What's up y'all? So back at the house and 
I'm about to get everything squared away so I can edit and stuff. So today was an awesome day. Can't complain. Um, from this morning. And from yeah, from this morning to a weird nightmare to seeing um beautiful animals um at a um farm and I took pictures and did a video of that so that was a good a good day it was because uh, every chance I get to see something different than with this eyesight is definitely a blessing so definitely no complaints about today but I'm gonna be up late doing these two videos cuz I'm gonna do um uh, the view of the view I saw part eight well all the pictures I took today then I do the life blog so it's two separate video uh, videos that I'll be doing so um but it'll be they will be coming soon but I'm definitely enjoying this um definitely enjoying sharing my life and sharing what my eyes see like with the pictures and the video and just uh, just being thankful for how things are going in my life and stuff so I definitely appreciate y'all I love y'all um, definitely continue to rock with me feel free to comment I will comment back to you so feel free to comment and and go from there because um, you're definitely gonna see videos every day so Cause I'm enjoying this. It's not even stressful at all. I'm not even stressful about this. I'm enjoying this. It's not even like you know. What I mean, it's like what you enjoy. Like you just want to keep on doing and doing it and keep developing and like new skills and stuff. Cause since I've been editing pretty much every day, I have been seeing that I improved in different areas of editing and stuff like that so I definitely saw that improved a lot in that and definitely comment below what you think about uh, so far what I've been editing and then putting stuff in and making it more interesting so that's what I want to just keep y'all I want it to be like you almost watching watching TV putting like my life blogs like that and just something that you can enjoy watching and and learn from or pick some up of encouragement and stuff like that so because it's not easy like you know what I mean with this eyesight of macular degeneration it's, it's not easy but each day it's like just being thankful that you're still able to see new things and and wake up so i'll definitely holla at y'all later i love y'all don't forget to subscribe like comment peace i'm out Cause we've been told that's the way our world goes round Walking on the grounds we've always known Stepping on the footprints in the snow But when it passed the other ways will show We're